The ancient Thai style pattern of basketry is an inherited from the fine, delicate, royal artisanal works. It showcases the courteousness, perseverance, and advanced weaving skills. Ban Bon Jai Chuai is currently 83 years old and living in Bang Plama subdistrict of Bang Plama district in Supanburi province. She's a descendant from Thai Puan or Lao Puan from Chiang Kuang province in Laos. Almost a hundred years ago, her ancestors migrated to live in Bang Plama, where thousands of Lao Puan families are also living now. These families speak Thai Puan language. In her childhood, Ban learned general weaving skills from her family, but it was not until 1985 that she started to weave seriously. In this community, villagers weave during their free time after farming to generate supplemental income for the family. Many years ago, Mr. Jirin Gan Danomai, a former governor, supported the community weaving group by providing specialized guest speakers to educate the community about weaving royal artisan patterns on rattan and bamboo wicker work. These patterns included durian thorn pattern, bullet wood flower pattern, and plumeria flower pattern. These patterns were considered difficult and complicated to weave. However, subsequently, the villagers were able to develop a new pattern called Wao Mayura, which originated from the bullet wood flower pattern. In the past, the 40 to 70 year old housewives would gather together to weave at each other's houses, and Ban Bon Jai Chuai was the leader of this group and oversaw their production and product distribution. The products included baskets, flat baskets, handbags, gift baskets, tissue boxes, vases, fruit trays, and cone shaped covers in various sizes. Materials used in weaving are bamboo and rattan. Weaving process. Step one, split bamboo into strips to form the main shape and structure. In this process, a hard wooden form is used to create the shape of the structure. Step two, whittle the rattan into strips. Step three, split the whittled rattan strips through a chocolate an aluminum plate with various sized small holes. The strips are pulled through the holes to smooth and standardize the shape of the pieces. Step 4. Soak the rattan in water to soften them. Step 5. Create the pattern by inserting wood. Start weaving the first part of the pattern until it has six rounds. If there are less than six, it will be a flower pattern. But if there are more, there will be gaps between the woven lines. So it is necessary for all of the rounds to fit fully together. Bun said that for us to be able to make a basketry product, we need to be experienced, dedicated, and highly patient. And if the younger generations show interest in this art, it will keep the local handicraft knowledge alive so it can continue to exist further in the future, preventing the loss of such valuable wisdom from Thai society.
The meticulousness in weaving a delicate work requires perseverance and experience, which have been gained over decades. And this knowledge can only be gained by those who work with a passion for the art. Only when the work is done with love can it be successful. In the future, it will be what makes us appreciate our country's progress and culture.